<clears throat> Peace, you powerful ass manifestors. It is I, your favorite fucking prophet is. <laughs> Y'all already know I am, so. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. 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 It's prophet is awesome, by the way. <laughs> Put some respect on that man. Anywho, so speaking of respect, I, I came here today and this is a channel message, right? So I may do a reading later. I don't know. But um, I had to get this out again, you know. Uh, we always talk about we do not war against flesh, but we get, we battle against powers and principalities. And I want y'all to understand, a lot of y'all have closed cycles. Y'all have entities have been chasing your bloodline. And maybe there was some dark shit that happened with your ancestors or somebody's ancestor did some dark shit on your bloodline. But whatever it is, you came back, baby. You are the retribution, all right? So who you are authentically, the love that you bring, and your faith is what Spirit just said, okay? Most of all, all right? You are having faith within yourself, within God, and now your light is shining bright. Alhamdulillah. And the darkness is pissed off, okay? Pissed off. So, <clears throat> Spirit is saying a lot of you have called back your ancestral wealth because a lot of this, um, these curses that have been put upon some of these bloodlines, because uh, these are elite bloodlines they don't fuck with, right? So, the power, I mean, the uh, some of these curses or spells or whatever you want to call it, okay? Because um, people do that shit. Keep staying blind to it, okay? Um, but you came back, and when you came back and you started to step into your power, you called back in your ancestral wealth. If you've been feeling like your family has been stealing from you, or and maybe they did, okay? Um, but uh, it was all for a purpose, right? You're calling back your not only your ancestral wealth, but you're calling back your ancestral gifts, okay? A lot of these were stripped from you because people greedy as shit. All right, and always want something for nothing, yeah, but not realizing it's gonna cost you in the long run. So, y'all had to come in and clear that up, and now you have called it back into rotation. So, be prepared for your money energy to open up, okay? I've spoken it. So, a lot of you guys, like I said, are going to be getting new opportunities. Okay, uh, and whatever that is to you, because like I said, wealth is different for everybody. Some people might want to just travel around the world, get an RV and travel around the world. That's wealth to them. Then that's what you shall have. Okay, so whatever it is, and uh, it may be like an overcast or um, like a cloudy day where you're at. All right, or within the spirit said the last three days it's been like that. That could be a sign. You could also be seeing butterflies, white butterflies, okay? You could also be <clears throat> seeing like um, just noticing a lot of people starting to look at you, stare at you, you know, uh, you may be going out more. You are now opening up to your authentic self <clears throat> and these entities have been shut down period point blank and you have called back in your ancestral wealth you could be seeing a lot of ants too you could be seeing a lot of uh gnats flies because you got a lot of monitoring spirits okay a lot of people want to know you must be moving in silence good keep doing that all right keep confusing the enemy all right dance i hear all right so some of y'all you can manifest dance is a form of meditation where you can allow the spirit to possess you take over you all right and manifest certain things <clears throat> <clears throat> so some of y'all need to, I just heard, dance on the devil neck, okay? Dance on their neck. But, um, yeah, congratulations for beating King Koopa, right? Yeah, y'all are definitely defeating the um, these dark entities that thought that they had you, right? And some of them um, were manifested uh, this lifetime through your family, through your co-workers, through your so-called friends, you know, and some even through your lovers, all right? So, but, uh, cause they wanted to keep you in a dark sunken place. But, um, as I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil for God is with me. His rod and his staff, they comfort me. So continue to be comforted, my divine ones, and get ready to let the good times roll, right? They should already be rolling is what spirit just said. Okay. You've been seeing it trink trinkle in and now it's, it's about to speed up. And I'm excited to see it, okay? So I love y'all so much. 
continue to do what you do and be the beautiful person that you are and continue to operate in your authority and divinity because nobody can take it from you. Stay up on your spiritual hygiene and your physical hygiene, right? Because they work in all ways to try to take us out. But at the end of the day, bitch is up and it's stuck for the divine light. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, all right? So, yeah, they want to come sit at the cool table. Yeah, you're not invited. We don't do that here. Go forth with the power of source behind you. Dare to be different. Dare to dream your destiny and stay the fuck aligned. Divine. What? <laughs> Itch and fine. Peace out.